You're watching KTN Prime. Let's cross borders now. Heavy gunfire and explosions today rocked Burundi's capital, Bujumbura, a day after, a day hours after the top Burundian general announced that he had launched a coup. It remains unclear whether the coup meant to oust President Pierre Nkurunziza was successful as two factions of soldiers, one supporting the president and the other conducting the oust, both say they are in charge. This happens as fear among the country's citizens continue to soar. Sharon Momani reports. Fear and tension have gripped residents of Bujumbura as heavy fighting and gunfire continue to rock the city. This was found by the coup announcement made by Burundian general and former intelligence chief Godfrey Niyombare on Wednesday. The general ordered the closure of Bujumbura airport and the landlocked nation's borders and declared that he had the support of many high-ranking army and police officers. This hindered President Pierre Nkurunziza, who was in Dar es Salaam, from flying back into the country. And Thursday, soldiers allied to the president fought to reclaim control of the city. However, it remains unclear whether the coup was successful. Army Chief of Staff Prime Niongabo took the national radio to condemn the coup. Nkurunziza has been seeking a third term in office, which the country's constitution outlaws. This has sparked days of violent protests in the country, with the attempted coup being the latest activity. The East African community has urged the country to put on hold the elections scheduled for next month, advising that the environment is not conducive for the process at the moment. The country, which is home to about 10 million people, is reeling from a decade-long civil war that ended in 2003. The war was ethnic-based, and observers fear that the ongoing political conflict may plunge the country back into war. More than 20 people have died, with the UN reporting that about 70,000 refugees have streamed into the Democratic Republic of Congo, Tanzania, and Rwanda. Charmani, KTN.